Hey there everybody and welcome back to Miss Pandaria Beta. My name is Dasbell and I'm here to show you another part of the August Celestials daily quest. Now you get to go to right now, Jade Serpent Temple is not involved, but the four I'm assuming Jade Serpent will be joined because of this right there. Elon the Jade Serpent, Fifth Giver of the East. Yeah, I'm assuming you'll be able to go to all four eventually, but for right now, you can only go to three. The last one I have to do is Nizao Temple which Nizao Temple far to the west is under attack by the Mantid. The Great Celestials hold them back for now, but he cannot stand forever alone. Forever alone! Go and help the defenders, Death Knight. The temple must not fall. So now you just go on over, so I'll be over there in a moment. Okay, so I've arrived at the Nizao Temple. Nizao, he's so happy. Still standing there. Not doing nothing. Well met, Death Knight. We need your help. The Mantic continue to attack us. Their numbers ebb and flow, but do not stop. It is no matter. The Yak is stamina embodied. We will, not, we will not bend to them. We will defend his home forever. Will you help us? Kill 12 Mantid, pretty much. <laughs> there is no time to hold to tradition. Our Mason's calloused hands bleed and tremble. Our blacksmiths cannot forge weapons as quickly as our sentinels can break them. It is time to fight smart. Many of the Mantid come bearing weapons, and when they die, they simply leave them on the battlefield. It would be a shame to see them go to waste. Just, if you die, how can you take your weapon with you? It's like, oh, my spirit is going to take this weapon away. Goodbye! Mantid, away! No. No. Fallen Sentinels. Our Sentinels can fight for days on end, but even when, but even they have their limits. Since the Mantid Swarms began, that too many of them have pushed themselves far beyond their abilities. Please aid them in whatever way you can. If you are unable to heal them yourselves, you may give them some of this. A mouthful of nutri nutritious yak milk will give them the strength they need. Heal eight wounded Nizal Sentinels above 50% health. You may use the yak's milk class or your healing spells. Cool. Yak milk. Blast. Cool. There's sort of like a uh, quest sort of like that over near Hatred's Vice in the Gatland Battlefront. They were fighting for so long you wanted to just help them out and pretty much relieve them of their duty. Um, and they were like, oh, rations. I was just expecting rations, but you're giving me time off. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Our patron Nizao is on the mountain, is a mountain on wheels. Very difficult to move, even more difficult to stop my point. Once we get him moving, the Mantid will have the, their arms full trying to slow him down. The easiest way to get him moving is to put food in front of him. Luckily for us, food in our temple is plentiful, even in wartime. I'll send one of my strong arms with you to shoulder the load. Obtain six stores of his how food. Okay, so I think we're going to do that food one first. Yeah, 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 stop talking and help me out. But if you think about it... Oh, nope, that quartermaster's still not in. If you think about it, if you get the food and you get him moving, technically you'll be able to kill the Mantid faster. Because, from what I've seen, he just runs straight through anything and pretty much if you get the tag, you can hit him once and he'll kill him for you and it's like really, really quick, really easy. Where's all the food? Food? Hello? Is it like not actually in the temple? Like it shows it's back here. Um, no. I don't know. That guy doesn't get a flying mount. That's weird. A lot of other NPCs would. There you go. Drink your milk. It's good for you. Gives you strong bones. Strong bones. Is that gonna get them up to 50%? It's not? What? Oh my god, this is horrid. Ah, that's annoying. Oh, I have to channel it. Oh, okay. So when I started moving away, they were like, but I wasn't done. 
Oh no, even then, it doesn't get him to 50%. Oh, this is lame. What the? Why does he have a hat on? What? Did someone just throw that at him? What? What's happening? I guess that's how they gather food, but I'm not gathering the food. Oh my god. I'm so confused. <laughs> this questing area is insane. It's just pure madness. Guess that's what you get with the axe. Talking to yaks. Madness. Heal up faster. Oh god. So far daily quests haven't been that bad because they haven't been annoying like this. This is a really annoying quest though. So this one sucks. <laughs> hold on, hold on, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna force all this milk down your throat. At least I'm frost. Oh oh no way I should be in frost by this. And everything I hit dies horribly. And quickly. And twenty runic power. Hey, you. Bugger off. No pun intended, just because you're a bug. There we go. And lots of weapons. The only thing I don't like about AoE loot is it doesn't work on, like, use effect things, like retrieving this. It does make sense, but then again, they could always set it up as to where it's just like, Oh, I'm gonna loot this, and this, and this. Nope. Trila, these mantis are very, very easy to kill. I like that. Okay. Let's see if I can get that tag on that. Oh no. Nope. If they're too low on health, though, it looks like you won't be able to get the tag. So that kind of sucks. I was able to get him though. Yo, out of here. And more weapons. Give me all the weapons. That's weird too because I remember a quest earlier on, I think in this area actually. Um, it says how the manted weapons are poisoned with a very powerful poison. And so if we use them, wouldn't we be attacking the mantid with poison? And I mean, one would assume that being a bug, being a mantid, you're not going to be susceptible to poison. Oh my god, runes. But, I guess these mantid are... Get over here. That, I, I don't know if those two foods on his head like count as I got food for him. This is strange. These quests are weird. I don't understand anything. I like having Death Siphon for Frost too. I didn't really realize this before. But this way, you can use a Death Siphon with your Death Runes that you'll always have, and then you can use a uh, Death Strike with your runes that you would use for Obliterate. So it's a little less weird on your rotation, because Unholy has a lot less steady, like, steady flow where of Unholy uh, Death Runes. <laughs> unholy Runes. Oh, oh god, oh god! Bugs, calm down. I'm freaking out. Freaking out, man! Whew. Thank you for AoE looting and overpowered frost. Okay, let's go force feed some more sentinels. Drink! Drink, you silly yak fool! Drink more! Drink it, drink it, yes. Oh no, wait, yeah, there are foods over there. Okay, so let's go... Heal this guy. Yeah. Yeah. Healing with milk. It's a wonderful food source. Yeah. Ooh, that guy was carrying bread. <laughs> he was like, I got it, I'm running. Now my guy is too- oh, that's very annoying that his animation is changing, but I'm not getting credit. 
Come on, I want to find some. I want some food too. My yak friend is hungry, just like yours. Actually, I'm going to fly up there really quick after I force feed a couple more of these guys. So I can turn these three in. But then I can also see if you have to literally bring the food up in front of them. And then it counts as, there you go, you're done. Because just gathering it for Nizao, the giant yak. But, I don't know. I have a feeling it's going to suck to get those foods right now. It seems like the proc uh, spawn rate is pretty low because I haven't really seen any. Yeah, people are getting them. Come on. Wake up. There you go. Eat of eight. Turn them in! Okay, bring it in front of them. Huh? Nope, I actually have to pick it up. Okay. Makes sense. You fight like you're one of us. Our men are accustomed to fighting with maces and clubs. Unfortunately, we have low time for customs. I will see to it that these are properly distri uh, distributed. What's more, I'll make sure our blacksmiths get a rest. Zhao knows they deserve it. Times like these, we must trust in the power and protection of Nizao. Should things get any worse, he will protect us. He always does. Oh, ain't he just a kind little yak? Yes, I know he's not tiny. Okay, let's find me for some foods. Find me some foods. There's one! Barely saw that sparkling. There you go. Come with me, you foolish Pendarn. Okay, look very carefully. Go away! Look very carefully. Hello? Is that food over here? Oh, there is food! Ha ha ha! I shall steal all the hay! This guy's going to look super stupid after. Super! Stupid! Oh, ha ha! I mean, he doesn't have rubber arms, he can't carry all this. He may be super. But no, no rubber arms. Okay, come on, come on, food. Where are you? I'ma look up here, you have a turtle pet. Ha ha ha. Gimme your wheat. How are you gonna carry that one? Oh my god. I wish I could just like continually gather this and see how ridiculous this guy gets. This is cool though because if he picks up the wheat, he looks different f compared to if he's picking up the little bucket things or like lunch boxes. Oh, another lunch box. There we go. You look absolutely crazy. Hello, Nizao. I'm flying through you. He will get up soon. Maybe not today. But soon, and when he does, <laughs> well, that's a weird end to the quests. That's a really weird end to the quests. <gasps> wow. Okay then. Huh. Well, oh, well, I'm fine. I'm moving forward. I guess that's all for now. So, yeah. Yeah, I guess I'll see you next time. Um, when they open up Jade Serpent Temple again, or Jade Serpent Area, Jade Forest Area, I will show you that area. It's because I'm, like, they went to all three of the other Celestials. They went to the White Tiger, they went to the Red Crane, and they went to now the Black Yak. Black Ox? Yeah, Black Yak. So, I can't imagine they would ignore the Jade Serpent Temple. I mean, I've even seen the phased, different-looking area of Jade Serpent Temple, so... I will show you that when Jade Forest gets back open, and that's all for now. I'll see you next time.